Eagles plus five and a half right now against the Cowboys. Which one? Like, who am I picking? No. Is this a Simon Says? Or is this a Big Balls? Are we making an executive decision? It's one of those. <laughs> For this game? Yeah. Yeah, it's, uh, if anyone out there, you could still grab the six. You grab the six, obviously, for the Eagles. Um, this is going to be a, a huge, a hugely debated game. Like me and Chad, this was going to be a guaranteed bet on Dallas for us. When this game opened and Hertz was healthy, this was a no brainer bet on taking Dallas here. Uh, they had a horrible loss. Eagles had an incredible win. Not incredible, but just a really gutsy win where that, that Bears game, that was such a letdown spot. That you would think, okay, Eagles are going to get all the public love in the world because no one's going to get why a 13 and one Eagles team is an underdog to this Dallas team at home. But it just made sense. This was going to be a good matchup for this Cowboys team at home. I, how can we not take Eagles? Like you're getting plus six, plus five and a half now with Minshew. I agree. It's a big step down from Jalen Hurts, but we've already seen Minshew. Kind of be in this situation before. Last year, he came in and played against the Giants. The Eagles won that game, and he played well. I think he threw for, for 200 yards, had two passing touchdowns, like a QB rating of 119. Eagles are just really good. Like, they're all around are just really good. They have good receivers. Dallas Goddard's coming back this week. This was going to be such a great letdown spot for this Eagles team in the sense that, yeah, I know it's Dallas week. This is usually the game they lose. Like, we usually split with Dallas. I love the Eagles in this position. Like the, the fact that they're this big underdog now, the coach is already wearing the underdog hat, like just getting the guys fired up out. Everyone's already counting them out because Hertz is out. We've already seen all the players talk about it. Next man up. And now this this morning, uh, Sirianni said he's not counting Hertz out. He said he met with the trainers and they said he heals differently than all us. He could be playing this week. Sure, that could just be simple smoke screen. You know, yeah. it doesn't matter to us though. We're getting a good number. So to me, if you can still grab the six, you grab it. But it's just another game. I mean, you can't avoid, right, Chad? It's an overreaction to an injury on a team that there's a reason they're thirteen to one. I mean, Hertz is incredible. Minshew isn't that horrible. Is he three or four points worse? Yes, but is he six, seven points worse? No, and that's just an overreaction by the public. I also feel like um, Gardner Minshew in one game is different than Gardner Minshew as your starting quarterback. Gardner <laughs> right. Minshew in one game is a straight out baller. Love it. Yeah. Like that's the mentality you want out of him, the one game. Is this Simon says or is this big balls? Well, big balls is Thursday. Oh, that's right. So yeah. is it Simon says? No, I'm I'm I feel like we're gonna end up on the same game for what we're both saving for. So it's okay. up to- we might right. we might want to be stepping on the same game. Is your game on Monday night? You're saving your 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 pick for. I was okay. So yeah, we can make this. Simon says. Are you sure? Yeah, yeah, yeah.